alright, this is uh, part of a demo of a game I'm working on based on Ender's Game, the book. Uh, it's based on Slick Util and LWJGL, which is the same stuff that Notch uses in Minecraft. Um, let's see, so I've got a few textures, some sounds, they're all public domain, uh, and I c I'm allowed to use them. Uh, the basic game loop is really simple, it's just that. Uh, everything is an entity, which means it's a vector. You've got players, you have bullets, and you have stars, which are basically just boxes with collision detection. And, uh, yeah, so I'll just show you the actual game. And I'll just let it load up. Just for the record, the uh, screen recorder makes everything really low fidelity, but the actual game is uh, much higher resolution. It just looks a lot better than this. This is just the screen recorder, uh, and also the mouse. Uh, the screen recorder requires a mouse, but there, there isn't a mouse in the center of the screen. So you can shoot and you can jump. There, those are the two controls. Uh, shoot with the left mouse button and jump with the right mouse button. You can also do that with uh, Z and X keys, just in case you're on a laptop and you don't have a mouse. Uh, basically, you just jump around and shoot things, and when this becomes multiplayer, when you shoot somebody, they'll freeze, and they won't be able to move as effectively. That's part of the actual game in the book. All these boxes are placed randomly, they're called stars, and uh, you can latch onto them and mount onto them, and you basically just jump around. There's no up or down. Uh, you can go around in all directions at zero gravity. That's one of the uh, things that's really hammered in, in the book. Uh, basically, it's just kind of interesting. It's been my pet project for a little while, and I thought I'd uh, put together a thing. There is a full screen mode, but I don't think the recorder will let me use it. Uh, everything else works pretty fine now. Alright, that's it.